welcome to the Accord Offer Supplies online ordering site. This video tutorial is the beginning of our online video tutorial suite designed to help you use our online ordering site more effectively so you can get the most from it. This video will talk you through how to place your order, including where to find your contract or core products, finding alternative products and taking you through the basket and order confirmation stages. Firstly, you need to navigate to www.accordoffice.com. This website is optimised for use in Google Chrome and Internet Explorer and will load our homepage. Here you'll find the most up-to-date information including any service notifications so please take a moment to read it before logging in. To view your pricing please log in. If you've not been set up please contact our customer services team on the details shown on screen. Alternatively please contact your business manager. If you've already got a login please enter it now. If you've forgotten your password, simply click here and you'll be prompted to enter your email address. Click Sign In. This is the home page. You'll find the main product catalogue navigation on the left hand side, including your contract products, the supplies wizard, otherwise known as the cartridge finder, and further down here you'll find our Globe and Tick certified range, which is our environmentally preferred products, your favourite products, previous orders, order templates and email sign ups and on the right hand side you'll find your details here, your contact should you wish to speak to us via email regarding a query, current offers and promotions are listed below and we've got our link to our blog here where you'll find our most up-to-date news and promotions. There are a number of ways that you can place your order. I'm going to show a few of these to you but the first thing I'm going to show you is how to navigate through your contract products or core products. Go to your contract products here located on the left hand side it will take you through your category. In this instance, I'm going to show you how to find paper that's on your contract list or core product list. Follow through the selection until you find the paper or item that you would like to order. This is the product page. You will find the product image, and you can view a larger image of the product by clicking on it, here. Further down, you'll see the description of the product and product information, so for example if it's a Globe and Tick product or if it's a direct delivery product will be found here. We'll go into alternative products later. You can add this item to your basket simply by clicking on quantity. Because this paper comes in a box of five reams, it's in quantity five. So for example if you wanted two boxes, you'd click once and it would say ten. That accounts for two boxes of paper. Click order. You'll see up here that your shopping basket now reflects the products that you placed in there. To amend the quantity, you can go back to the up and down arrows, change the quantity as required, and this button next to it will change to the word change. Click here to confirm the change, and you'll see up here that the confirmation will change. It's always worthwhile checking the alternative products tab to ensure you're shopping around for the best value product. Here you can see we have a white box paper on offer at a lower price. As I only require paper for internal use, I'll order this instead. I can order it directly from the alternative products tab, or I can click on the name of the product which will take me to the product page. I'd like two boxes, so I'll order two quantities, which equates to ten reams of paper across two boxes. Click order, and you can see here it's confirmed there, and the items have changed in the shopping basket. You can also find your products by using the search box. In this case, I'd like some big pens, so I'll type in my search term big pen, hit enter, hit enter, and the results will appear in front of you. I'd like to know what the cheapest item is, so I'm going to sort here, price 0 to 9. Allow that to load, and you can see here that you've got the lowest price item. I'm going to scroll down until I find the product I want. I can order the product directly from this screen, or I can click in to take me through to the product page. Now, I can place my order here by simply, as I did before, clicking order, and you can see here it's confirmed that I've ordered a pack of 20, or I can go back to the product page where everything's listed and actually place my order here. You can see here it's confirmed that I've ordered 20. However, if I wanted two boxes, I change the quantity to 40, click change, and it'll confirm that I've changed my order. Progressing your order is simple. Simply click on checkout in the top right hand corner and you'll see the items in your basket. You can remove an item from your basket simply by selecting the cross. To change the quantity of an item within your basket, simply use the up and down arrows and you'll see that the red calculator changes 
click here to recalculate and it will amend the price and the quantity within your basket. The Your Memo fields underneath each of the product descriptions is simply an internal reference that only the online ordering site will save. This will not go onto your delivery notes or your invoices. Click Next. Depending on how your account is set up will determine how this screen will look. Select your shipping address. Click on the Select button here. It will show you the list of all of your addresses. If you require a new address to be set up, please contact the customer relations team on the details to the right. Again, same thing for invoicing address. If you'd like that amended, please email them. Select your address. You can do the same for the invoice address. Click on the select button, click on the address you require, and it will automatically fill in for you. Now, if you have a cost center like I do, you'll need to select this from the drop down. You may have a fixed cost center, and it may already be there. In the box to the right of it is the delivery contact. This is specific details that you would like to appear on your delivery note. I'm going to put marketing department. You have a limited number of characters here, so be mindful what you put in. Your memo here is an internal reference used for the online ordering site only and won't be printed on your delivery note or your invoice. You can click on show order overview to check that you've got everything you wanted. Press the top right hand corner here to close and click next if you're happy with all the details that you've entered. You'll be shown here your invoice total including VAT. If you're happy with this then you can proceed and depending on how your account is set up you'll either have place order or request authorization. In this instance I have to send all my orders through to the marketing manager. You may have one or two people that you can send this to so for example if one person's on holiday you can send it to the other person. Select this from the drop down list. Again, you can click on Show Order Overview so you can double check what you've ordered. Click the top right hand corner to close this. I'm going to click here to request authorization. Keep a note of your order number here so that you can use this for reference later should you need to contact us about your order. If you pay by credit card, you'll be prompted for payment on the next screen. If you're invoiced for your goods, your order will immediately be sent to our system for processing. Place your order simply by clicking here and if you pay by credit card, you'll be prompted for payment on the next screen. But if you're invoiced for goods like I am here, your order will immediately be sent to our system for processing. Keep a note of your order number. You will receive an acknowledgement of receipt for order email detailing the online ordering references, and a more detailed order acknowledgement email will follow shortly afterwards detailing all products, prices and delivery addresses.